Hi everybody, my name is Mike. This is Luca. Luca is an available dog in our training program. And today I'm going to help him help Luca strengthen his in command as well as work on a few other things. So you see, Luca's not in a collar or I mean a, a leash rather. Normally I would recommend training with a leash on, but today the leash may get stuck during the crate game and that's going to be unpleasant and we don't want that. We want to have this game to help build some positive associations with the crate. So it's an easy game. A couple things, I've got some treats as well as I took the blanket out of that crate so that it'll make noise. That's another thing that'll help a pup track down the treat. And I'll show you the crate game that we play. We play with all the pups. It goes like this. In. Sometimes it takes two treats. In. Good. Okay, come. Good. Luca, in. Good. Okay, Luca, come. Good. Good boy. Luca, in. So you can see how that can turn into a fast-paced fun game for dog and owner as well as help the pup build some positive associations. Luca's got a few basic commands. He's got a good sit. He's luring on his down and down. <laughs> My bad. Sit. Luca's definitely still on the lure stage while this good. There's no least pressure, there's no correction. If he fails the command, I'm simply going to lower him into position. Luca, sit. No, good. Good pop. I will. Negative marker is a mistake, however. Luca, sit. Good. Good boy. And you'll notice with this, good, there's no command because you shouldn't label a command until you love it. And lay it out. I believe that Luca needs a little more work. Luca, sit. Good. Down. Good. Good boy. <laughs> Except that time I, I felt like labeling it because I knew that he was going to go down, not moving him. Uh, one more time. Sit. Down. <laughs> Good. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So, Luca's done good with this, and I'm going to go ahead. We're going to end this and put this on YouTube. Talk to everyone soon.